Virgo, what do the cards hold for you in regards to love at this time? What are the messages for Virgo crew? Divine timing is at play for somebody a Sagittarius is on the way, but you're waiting. Somebody is getting to know a new person. Air, Emperor Aries energy below you. Okay. Um, interesting. So divine time is coming into play to deliver to you a divine masculine is what I'm getting. Okay. But the, here's the thing. You're going to have to deal with your codependency first, anxiety issues, separation, anxiety um, and abandonment issues. They're saying divine timing will come into play, but God is standing in the way in your love life until you deal with separation issues and abandonment issues, codependency issues, and the idea that you're just not good enough. You don't deserve love. Yeah, all that stuff. You need a new headspace about that. That's what's affecting your love life most strongly at this time. This idea that you're with you, you can never do it by yourself. Like it's you need somebody else. There's some sort of idea that you need some other. But spirit says, no, baby, you were given everything inside of yourself. Yes, the change comes when you find your value, your worth, and your love within, and let that be more important than anything. In other words, your divine masculine will be ready, but not until you're ready. So you got to embrace, embrace that divine energy. See, the divine counterparts, they have no codependency. They have no um, abandonment issues. They aren't sitting up here like, well, what I'm going to do while well, they busy at work? I don't know what to do. I'm going to lose my mind because they ain't around here. They ain't call me. They ain't text me. That, that is not divine counterpart energy. So somebody here uh, you definitely, yeah, you're be def definitely being guided to get a handle on this codependency and abandonment issues. Give me some guidance for my bird. My bird, okay, my beautiful uh, Virgo tribe. Page of Cups. Interesting. They're saying it's important for you to address why do you choose to focus on something that keeps you at a distance, okay? So it seems like you've been choosing immature lovers that are kept at a distance from you. And this is an ongoing cycle for you, okay? When you can have love that's happy and full-fledged full right inside, in front of your face, you keep choosing something at a distance from you. Mm -hmm. The Ten of Wands, okay, they're saying you're going to have these joyous love connections come in once you let go of these ideas that love is not really for you and it nev never comes true. Yeah, there's a release of a lot of old energies. And the thing of it is, the idea that, not having somebody is painful. That's the problem here for you. Okay, bonus card, magician. Those ideas are manifesting for you quickly. That's what we have for you, Virgo.